we got a new shoe. Now, Himiku is a brand that we've had around for a lot of years. Um, really into funky sneakers, uh, wedges. I wear it a lot. It's um, a brand I wore it yesterday, I wore it the day before, especially in their EVA wedges. Now, a shoe that came into the catalogue this season that we weren't expecting was Florence. So Florence is a very traditional court shoe from Hineku. Um, haven't had anything like this from before, so we're a bit excited when it came in. Goes up to a size 46, which we're like, oh, that's a bit interesting. Let's have a look at what the fit is like. Fit is good, comfort is good, um, leather is spectacular. So now I've got the black here and I'll pull the navy out because the navy is gorgeous and it's a really, it's a different navy to what our other court shoes have. So, sorry. All right, now you will see the immediate feature that I love and that's this back bit. And this is what Bernie and I were talking about straight away is the padding and everything. Because with these sorts of shoes, that's the section that normally hurts your foot or you get blisters or you feel like you're slipping out of it. This is really designed to stay on your foot, which we like. You've got that really nice, it's a square sort of heel, block heel. And it is leather wrapped, so you've got that leather coming the whole way down. And the lining on the inside and the padding on the insole is super nice. So, I'm just checking which size I've got. So I've got to get the navy to get my size. So I'll show you the navy as well, so you can see the difference in the two of them. Navy's nice. Oops. Navy is one of those colours we find really, really hard to buy because sometimes it comes really blue and other times it comes almost black. Um, so it's hard to find that nice mix. Now that's the navy there. So it's a really genuine navy colour. Like it's just beautiful. I didn't say before with the black, it has got that slightly um, rounded boxy toe there as well. So it is a bit different and you can see all that at the back. Now I've pulled the 44 out in the navy. So I'm going to put that on so you can see it on the foot. Now I'm normally a 45, so I have tried the 45 on when we were doing the photo shoots and it was too big for me. So I haven't tried the 44 on before, um, but I grabbed it out for this. The top's sort of giving away on me a little bit. All right, you'll see the the um, little try on spree I've been having and making videos this morning for you. So sorry about that. You'd think I'd clean it up, but it's always, it's like the washing. You kind of leave it to the absolute last minute before you have to do it. Okay, so got the navy on here in the 44. So putting her on, I'm straight in. Oh, geez, that's good. All right, the other one, straight in. Um, I don't need to put my finger in there. I just feel like I'm being very careful because they're not my shoes and I don't want to damage them. Um, but I am, like you can see, I'm just sliding in. But then once I'm in it, I feel really secure. So this section here, um, is right like it's not firm it's not loose it just feels right for me so if anything the tiniest bit firm which is what i would want in this sort of shoe because you need to allow the leather to stretch just that little bit so it's supporting your it's fitting your foot right which is what i can feel is going to happen there lengthwise is good i've still got a good centimeter and a bit um this just feels great on my heel now it's important when you're trying on shoes when you're sitting in them and there's one thing when you stand in them it's completely different so if you're going into shoe shops and the only thing you're doing is trying them on sitting down please stand up it's like the m&m song please stand up please stand up anyway um please stand up because it changes the way your foot is in the shoe it changes the way um, your foot forms, it flattens out a little bit, you'll feel pressure in spots that you don't feel when you're sitting. It's important you stand up, it's important that you take a few steps, get a feel for them. If the shop lets you, go for a walk around in them. Um, try to stay on carpet if you can, just for the damage in case you don't wear them, don't keep them. If you're trying our shoes on at home, please try them on on carpet. But it, that's an important feature, stand up. Because at the moment, this shoe is feeling freaking phenomenal. Um, like just, like, leather glove on my foot. So I'm gonna stand up and make sure it still feels the same. Pretty sure it will. Okay, so, all right, yeah, that feels really good. I'm really firm. So the 45 is definitely too big for me. Um, I was just slipping out of it and I was really grabbing with my toes to stay in the shoe, which you don't want. You want the shoe to stay on, right? Um, so that's just feeling, yeah, that's really good. Really, really good. Um, where is she? All right, so that's Florence there by Hineku. Um, fit, if you're anyone in a corporate office or really like a traditional court shoe, I recommend our other shoe options in this sort of style are the block heel. I might just grab one, hang on, I've got one in the background. Um, so that's the block heel there. And then that's the low square. So it's got the low one, they're the Hush Puppy shoes. And then this is our new one from Hineku. So 
I think if I'm rating them, this is actually a better fit for me. Um, the Hush Puppy ones, I kind of go in between sizes and they're a bit wide because they're a wider fitting shoe. Um, this one just fits perfectly on my foot. So this would be my pick if I was going between them. Um, if you're in if you're in Moranbar, come in and get in your work shoe. Um, if you're online, just give us a call if you need any sizing help. But yeah, navy, black, Florence, get it on your foot.